Hi everyone, it's Jen Eskridge from Rihanna Lily Designs Sewing Pattern Company. I'm the owner and designer at the shop and I wanted to show you today how I could make a whole bunch of half square triangles using a 2 and 7 8 inch square and seemingly accurate seam guide. So the first thing I need to do is line up my uh, diagonal line with this quarter inch mark, which is a quarter inch from the marked needle line, which has already been set up during the installation. And I have a video to that linked in the description. I'm going to take my top edge of my square and line it up with the edge of my presser foot and then the lower edge with the quarter inch. And the needle is going to go down right at the edge of the fabric. So as long as I am dragging this tail a quarter inch away from the needle line, it's going to sew a quarter inch from the imaginary diagonal line. When I get to the end, I can lift up my needle and presser foot, turn it, Again, matching this point with the edge of my presser foot and matching this lower edge a quarter inch away from the needle line. Now here's the cool part where you know your uh, triangles are going to be accurate. This first stitching line will now fall on the half inch mark. Thing that it's a quarter inch away from the diagonal and a half inch away from the other side. Now watch how fast I can make a whole bunch of half square triangles. Notice I didn't mark any diagonal lines, I didn't have to cut any threads, I just chain pieced them together, kept throwing in my squares, sewing a quarter inch away from the imaginary diagonal line. And the only thing left to do now is cut my triangles apart, aiming to cut in the center of those two stitching lines, I'm sorry, squares apart, to reveal a two and a half inch finished half square triangle block. To get your own seemingly accurate, Go to seeminglyaccurate.com or riannalilydesigns.com. They're both linked in the description. Thanks. I'll see you around.